Hey, what's up everybody? How you doing? Welcome back to Carpool Gaming and another Elden Ring video. Well, today we have a really cool video for you. I'm going to show you how you can get infinite runes early on when you first start off in Elden Ring. It's very, very helpful. So once again, thanks for watching everybody. Now let's get started. I'm not going to take up too much of your time. I know you want to get back to playing. First thing first, we're going to first, you need to head over to the third church. Yeah. Now where is that third church? Well, I'll show you right here on the map. When you first start off from the Church of Ella, you're going to make your way all the way over here to the gate front. And then from here, well, you're going to make your way all the way over to that third church right here. The third church of Marquea. Now, once we're over here, there is a portal behind that we can take. And inside of here, it's going to warp us to a whole new zone. And in that zone, there are some easy enemies that we can kill that's going to give us 1,000 runes. And you can kill these very easily. You can do this in under a minute. So if you do the math, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> you can kill in a minute. Yeah, that's over 60,000 rooms, ladies and gentlemen, in an hour. So yeah, unlimited rooms. Now, probably gonna patch this sooner or later, or maybe they take down the amount that they're gonna give us. But for right now, I highly suggest you get over there and form this as much as possible. Get your level up by everything that you want. So make sure right here behind that church, enter into the portal. And this is where it's going to take you, which is really, really cool. Now from here, we're going to make our way all the way down to another saving grace spot. See, I told you we're in a whole new area, right? Now there's a ton of enemies over here. All of these enemies that you see are the ones that we're going to be taking out, all right? Grab that seed and then head down over here to the saving grace. There's also a, a big giant dragon on that bridge over there. Just saying. <laughs> but we're not going to tackle that now. Here, we're about to form and get this infinite amount of lovely runes. Let's go, ladies and gentlemen. Now, here's the thing. If you're just starting off, you may be wondering, will I deal enough damage? Yes, it might take you a few swipes, depending on what class you're using i'm using the astrologer you can hit him on horseback like that it's going to take you a little bit longer right maybe about 30 seconds to kill him but still <laughs> you know what i mean it's very very fast even when you first start off but there is a more efficient way because you do have a sword with you you know don't matter what class you got you're gonna have two different things that you can roll with but if you do have a sword this is what i want you to do if you crouch down low you go with your sword and you hit on one behind them, you get a sneak attack, which is definitely going to take down a whole bunch of their health. And then all you have to do is switch to your lovely, lovely moves, which if you are an astrologer, you get them with that range and voila, just like that, 1,000 runes just like that. See what I'm saying? Boom, just like that, ladies and gentlemen. Stick them from behind and then go ahead and out. What's that? Yeah, make sure you you don't get hit because you can easily get one shot. Like I said, you are in an area where they're high level enemies, but still, 1,000 apiece, ladies and gentlemen. An infinite way for you can get runes early on. Do it, do it fast, hurry up, and get yourself some runes. But for right now, that's pretty much going for the video. Hope you truly enjoyed it. If you have any questions, let me know down below. As always, if you are new to the channel, how you doing? Welcome. Don't forget to subscribe. I upload a ton of videos. I hope you enjoyed this one. Thank you for watching. As always, I'll be seeing y'all in the next one.